So he, here's the model with the, the two hour model with the mirrors on it. Uh, then I took off the mirrors, uh, I put down paper on it, but the paper got wet and soggy and was useless, so I had to use a table mat instead. Um, I made the cuts in the table mat, plastic table mat. Not sure what this photo is for. Uh, then um, took out the cuts and um, popped it in again to make sure the measurements were okay. And um, this is uh, what the mold looks like after the measurements were taken. And um, coming up is the little mat. This is the mat, the mat laid down flat on some paper to mark it out so that I could um, figure out um, how big to make the, the real thing. So the real thing is actually on the length dimension is everything is increased by 3.8 times. And here it is again, a little tiny mold on a piece of graph paper. So this is what the uh, chloroplast looks like. Um, then uh, it was taped up and um, this is it from the front looks like a big scoop or something and uh, I put uh, mylar on it I used wheat paste which was one teaspoon in a cup of water or a tablespoon in a cup of water of wheat paste then out it goes before it was even dry and um, I used a pot and heat here's the latest state of clay um, we have um, it's 421 uh, the glue is still wet on this thing and I definitely have to set up a little better for maybe tomorrow anyway temperature 53.2 uh, starting to go up oh no it's gone back down again there it seems to be standing about that the cloud situation. It's not too bad, but it's high cloud, so can't really tell. 53.7. So that's that's her stuck at that for the day, I'd say. Um, I'll turn this off now. It was much too late in the day to do a heat test, and I've still got to put stays on the reflector so that it keeps its shape and I've got to uh, line it up with the path of the sun. So there's lots to do, but uh, I've made uh, good progress over the last couple of days. Thank you.